All right, and welcome everybody to the M07 Director today on Fear with You with a game I played it a long time ago, never really got far into it, it's called Vintage Burp. I see it's a two straw to drink here, I'm gonna need it, I am gonna almost have to drink, I need to drink, because it's tart. So this is kind of an audio game in a way, um, very interesting. Uh, yes, I would like to activate him because otherwise I'm not going to get this at all. This was a really big game a long time ago. I think it was really big. I know it was quite a popular game. And I thought it was amazingly cool. Uh, I'm going to figure out how things go. Sure is hot. I wish it was hot. It's currently freezing outside. Yeah. Freezing. It is the temperature outside. Thirty-six degrees and raining. Now I may have to change a setting or two while uh, going at this because it's loading. So I'm just going through my bank. Yeah. I get that and click okay. Move mouse or gamepad. W is speed to walk. Also I know shift is run. Space is jump. Uh, left click starts a spell, right click ends a spell. J is journal, which I guess I don't have. Should be able to see everything here. Right? Any controls, I can change everything from here. Unfortunately if I change any of the video controls, it uh, resets the game. I'm not sure this is how I'm supposed to do this, but I am. Okay, I guess I'm not. Come on. I wonder if I have stamina. Did I just run out? Do y'all see the screen tearing too? I don't think so. I do. Y'all do see uh, like a motion blur effect. Does hang up a little bit for y'all. Oh. See, uh, turn on V sync. This may make the game restart. Yep, I'll be right back. All right, and um, I'm sure I'm not right back in the same spot. So it doesn't look quite as bad as you know. I mean, I don't have that vertical V sync going on, which is fine. I'm aware of running. I've already been running. Oh, I see stuff. Oh. Okay. I've got my mouse sensitivity way too high, I think, as well. We'll figure that out as we go on. See, on the stream, it, it looks darker than what it is on here for sure. On stream, in my opinion, it actually looks better. In my opinion, I like how the stream looks more. Well, not it's not really stream; it's just recording. Look closely at it and press E. And what inscriptions? The one on the door. That inscription. Put that 
did it. Looks like it. Did the door light up? Hmm. I am um, back. Sorry, mom. Daughter woke up. It's still glowing. Just falling down pillars. Put these that stuff on them. I don't see anything on them. Journal does not work. Did I hear something? It's not jumpy on y'all then, it's jumpy because I'm jumping around by here. There's one fallen pillar. It's this one. There it is. I thought I know there's something on it. Hey, that's what the journal says. Uh, it says I got a mic in my way. That's what it says. Um, so, um, so you're studying the idiom known as Mahak. Mah Maha. Mahaki. Malaki. Um, which means the language of the creative deities. Yet I had only scratched the surface, although I had had examined numerous artifacts that reported scriptures in this language coming from places even very far from each other. I was able to interpret only a few fragments. Now in the in the entrance hall of this temple whose existence was not even a certainty something happened now i have a total understanding of the mahaki in in the past i did not believe in the legends but there is power in these written characters nice let's continue that was a good load see no god this ain't supposed to be a horror game now okay I guess I'm going through it. I like them. I saw that. I like the uh, crystals. No. No. Just stop running. Circle of Remembrance to save the game. Oh, Circle of Remembrance. Oh, flashing lights. Yeah, new save game. Upside one. Sure. Alright, where am I? I think that's probably the room I got stuck in last time. On the last time I actually played the game. I really should know where I am because this should be the entrance right here. I think that's where I am at. That was not me jumping, that was me hitting a ledge. All of the bloom! Wasn't there like a horizontal bloom option? Did I just turn that all the way up? Is that what happened? Horizontal bloom, yeah, I did. I might turn that down a little lower because that's pretty. pretty heavy. Like. Really, really heavy. I don't think nothing ever blooms that much. Um, I will be back. I know it's the third time I've had to pause it. I'll be right back, though. Alright, and I'm back. It's not as bad now. It's definitely not as bad. It's still present. I just turned it to weak. Instead of strong. It's the only option I get is weak and strong. Or none. 
I want to have it on. Oh, um, I'm going left. The left is always right, and I think left was the wrong answer. That was the wrong answer. That hurt. Pretty. I don't know why I always get like right up on things like that. Thought I saw something in that corner. Green crystal. Bookshelf. Mushrooms. Artifact. Don't I have that on, on me somewhere? Hmm. Oh. Genesis. In the beginning, there was chaos. With the passing of the era, chaos uh, something into a single physical mass. Other aeons passed, and the Agolithium took on a on a considerance. Whatever. In each moment of its existence, it would scripturize, scripturize the entire infinite space, and so for a time it was immense. Okay, I think it's the font that throws me off on this, in all honesty, because I'm not normally this bad at reading, but at the same time, the longer I read, the worse I get, and the more it hurts. Um, no, oh, so much. Then it saw in the universe the birth of something that remotely reminded it of itself. An intelligence, an intelligent life was born, and that was followed by many others, the same but different, all sharing the ability to consult constantly change the world that surrounded them. So its attention shifted from observing endlessly the birth of powerless pieces of the universe to praying greedily into the lives of these of these beings but one day something disturbing happened these living entities began to worship something undefined that they had never seen heard or heard or perceived which was in their opinion omni omniscient omniscient and Omnipotent. Okay, the names attributed by them by them were the most diverse, but it was obvious to chaos that the being was being was himself, since there was nobody else in the infinite remotely remotely comparable to him. Why is it saying it like this? I just happened. I don't know what that was all about. I would like to get to the other side, please. Can we? Can't make it down, please. I want to get to the <gasps> I can push things around. I don't know why that's so amusing to me. Too bad I can't break them. Is that blood? That's a face. I just tried to zoom like I was playing Minecraft. Okay, it's time for me to it's time for me to go home. It's time to go. I just tried to zoom like I was playing Minecraft. I press C to zoom. <laughs> Darn, his mouth over the is a little high. Just a hair. 
have to lock this one a little bit. Gamepad probably wouldn't do that if you're playing with either. I don't like that noise. Yeah, but I just... Is that water? Why don't I go splish to the sp uh, splish to the splash whenever I walk on it? Any secrets? Secret writing. Beyond darkness. Genesis system of beyond darkness. One of the first lessons to pilgrims was the invocation of light. This this to remain them this to remind them that first of all they must be the barriers of truth and illuminate their darkness hides and create fantasy click to hear scripture and i can't am i learning scriptures do i not know of these scriptures that was it back there new made tia Just learn the spell. I can't read all that well now. The light is not is not enemy of dark. Quite the contrary, it it is its complementary. Sister prays too much in the past. The world is based on this lie. The belief that the light necessarily necessarily repented the good that is opposed in the shadows and bans them. The balance between the two has always been in favor of blazing bright, blazing bright part of the creation, but no one has ever realized the importance of equality between them. Light and shadows are the same entity, the same essence, essence pervading the cosmos. When one of the two prevails, change its and something nothing remains equal to itself over time and the metamorphosis does not always lead to the order of chaos okay i'll give this one up it can feel i could feel it the dazzling power of light coming out of my hand an abs absolute sense absolute absolute sense of grace radiance from my hand after i said Lume, Lume Tiao, Lume Tiao, for the first time in darkness knelt before me. Lume Tiao. Learn the spell, its formula has been noted in the journal. Cast spell, hold the left mouse button and gamepad, right trigger, pronounce the formula, then release the button, end spell, right click. Lume Tiao. Lume Tiao. Lume, Lume Tiao. Lume Tiao. Lume Tiao. Lume Tiao. Oh, I cast light. It means I could go through that dark room, I guess. Oh. Lume Tiao. That would be a no. Oh, let me see which one is. Lume Tiao. Lou Maytiel. Lou Maytiel. Is there more to see in here? Little fire pit stones, I think. Push the stuff. Books, more books. That is definitely blood with a face. Okay. So these things turn off magic. Lume TL. Lume TL. Lume TL. Lume. That's a girl. There are faces on that too. This game is beautiful. So pretty. Lume TL. Hey, look, a walkway that I could see now. I wonder if anyone could ever accidentally guess this. Are there speed rooms of this game? That would be crazy.
I saw whatever that was in the corner of my screen. It's a loading symbol, okay. Oh. Can I jump? Probably not. I am hurt already by the trigger. Right. Yes, there's a hole in my health bar still. Did I make a copy of that map anywhere? Did I put it in my journal? That would be amazing. It's 21 minutes already. Let's see what's going on. Oh, that's a rock. Hey, look, a save circle. I think I'm going to save. And I'll have to call this episode here. All right, until then, I hope y'all have enjoyed this. And I'll see you in the next episode here. I'm really wanting to do a full playthrough of this game this time. I know I've done a bunch of games like this and I've never completed them before. Either because I get stuck in a spot or I mess up or I just lose interest. But this is a game I've always wanted to get back to. And I've just never done it because I, I got stuck in a spot and it was just disencouraging. But we'll see about it this time. Till then, I hope you all have enjoyed this, and we will see you in the next video of uh, Verbus Vincis. Whatever the hell it is called. It's, uh, yeah. Verbus Vincis. And I'll see you next time. Bye.